Hello everyone, my name is Tejas and welcome back to my channel Self Study with Tejas. And if you are passionate about computer science and aiming to excel in the ICSO exam, then you are in the right place. So today we are going to learn ICSO chapter 3, History and Generation of Computers. So watch the video till the end and let's start. Chapter number 3, History and Generation of Computers. So question number 1, the image shows a dash and it is a vital component of the dash computers so this is a vacuum tube and it was used in the first generation computers so our correct answer here will be option number d now second question identify the computer generation so first bullet point microprocessors based systems second bullet point development of gui based operating system and third computer networking was introduced and fourth apple II is a is a example so first generation of computers are based on vacuum tube technology third generation computers are based on ics and fifth generation of computers are based on artificial intelligence so only fourth generation of computers are based on the given explanation so our correct answer here will be option number d so third question identify the following it was the web browser with support of multiple internet protocols second it was the first multimedia browser with graphical user interface third it was a navigation tool for interactive materials so a mosaic b internet explorer c safari d netscape navigator so uh, the given explanation only uh, is for mosaic so correct answer here will be option number a so question number four match the following and select the correct option so uh, first for first generation computer so vacuum tube is the first generation of computer which means a will go to one and now second generation computers so here the second generation computer will be this transistor which means uh, b will go to four and now third which is a uh, third generation computers so this is an integrated circuit which is a third generation of computers which means c will go to two and here our last fourth generation computers so uh, this is a microchip and this is a fourth generation of computers which means our correct answer here will be option number d so fifth question which of the following is not associated with fifth generation of computers so first ulsi second artificial intelligence and third cui system so ulsi which means ultra large scale integration and cui which means character user interface uh, so and now we have to first read the options here so a both one and two b both three and four c only fourth or d only three so here uh, in option number b third and fourth which is non portable are not an example of fifth generation of computers which means our correct answer here will be option number b so sixth question match the following and select the correct option so column one with column two so first n e n IAC which means electronic numerical integrator and computer so here this was invented by J. Presper Eckert and John Mochley so first we'll go to fourth and now second Colossus so Colossus uh, Colossus was invented by Tommy Flowers which means second we'll go to first and here third which is difference engine which was invented by charles babbage so this will go to two and here abacus so the inventor of abacus is uh, unknown so that's why here uh, the option is early calculate device also called as counting frame so this will go to three so our correct answer here will be option number b so seventh question which among the following was the first electronic general purpose com uh, computer so a univac b abacus c eniac or d mark one so eniac was the first electronic general purpose computer so our correct answer here will be option number c now eighth question the computers developed during the fourth generation of computers were smaller in size but yet were quite powerful the main concept behind their computation power was dash so a magnetic type b microprocessor c artificial intelligence or d transistors and capacitors 
so magnetic tape was the second generation of computer and here uh, correct answer here will be microprocessor which was a fourth was uh, which was a fourth generation of computers so here in option number c it was artificial intelligence which was fifth generation and the transistors and capacitors which were second generation so now ninth question Apple computers were developed in the 1976 who invented the first apple computer a bill gates b john von uh, neumann now c steve wozniak or d mark zuckerberg so our correct answer here will be option number c steve wozniak so our correct answer here will be option number c so 10th question identify the device shown in this picture so this is napier's bones which is a manually operated calculating device so our correct answer here will be option number d now 11th question which one of the following technique a uh, technologies was developed during the fourth generation of computers so a artificial intelligence b v l s i c vacuum tube or d robotics so vlsi was the uh, was the one of the following technologies which was developed during the fourth generation so our correct answer here will be option number b now 12th question the machine shown in this image records the uh, rate of heartbeat of a patient and displays it in digits it is an example of dash a analog computer b digital computer c hybrid computer and d calculating computer so this machine uh, is a type of hybrid computer so our correct answer here will be option number c now 13th question which of the following statement is correct so a tablet computer is a kind of micro computer b mini computers are a class of multi user computers c main frame computers are primarily used by the large organizations or d all of these so all of these statements are correct so our correct answer here will be option number d now 14th question which of the following is not true for the third generation of computers a integrated circuit was introduced b vacuum tubes were the main building blocks c relatively small and could be placed on a small tube d all of these so vacuum tubes were the first generation of computer and they were not used for the third generation of computers so our correct answer here will be option number b so 15 question match the names of the early calculating devices with their corresponding pictures and select the correct option so first is difference engine so this is a difference engine which means a will go to 3 and now b is napier's bones so this is a napier's bones which means this will go to 2 and pascaline so pascaline is a first calculator or adding machine so this is a pascaline which means 1 so our correct answer here will be option number c so achieve our section question number 16 match the following and select the correct option so lady augusta lovelace so uh, the, uh, this was the first lady programmer so the, uh, this uh, now second one charles babbage so charles babbage was the father of computers now see john von neumann so this was a suggested stored program concept and now fourth a gottrified wilm lebis so this was a me mechanical calculator which means our correct answer here will be option number c so uh, direction question number 17 to 18 given table represents the difference between the first and the fourth generation of computers now answer the questions that follows so which of the following options would replace 1 and 2 in the given table so note 1 and 2 are the devices that is used in an uh, input and output devices in the first generation of computer so uh, the uh, circuit is vacuum tube and input and output was used with the help of punch cards because then option number b c and d magnetic tape is given which was second generation of computers so our correct answer here will be option number a so 18th question which of the following options would replace 3 4 and 5 in the given table so note 3 the technology used in fourth generation of computer fourth output device used uh, used with fourth generation of computers and fifth example of fourth generation of computers so microprocessor was the technology used in fourth generation of computer and 
monitor was the output device with the fourth generation of computers and intel 4004 is an example of fourth generation of computer so our correct answer here will be option number a so 19 question which of the following statements holds true regarding univac 1 so univac means universal automatic computer so statement 1 it was the first commercial electronic computer developed by j preser expert and john mochi so yes this is correct and now statement 2 it was also the first computer to handle both numeric and text data so yes this is also correct which means the correct answer here will be option number c both statement 1 and statement 2 Now, twentieth question. Arrange the following technologies in their increasing order of their speed and reliability. So, uh, the speed of the computers varies according to their generation. So, Honeywell two hundred was a second generation of computer. Univac was a first generation of computer, and Intel processors was a fourth generation of computers, which means two, one, and three. So, our correct answer here will be option number. So if you liked our video please like share and subscribe to our channel thank you